Today we're out, actually we have a couple of goals today out here in the woods uh, above Ripert's for there. Uh, right now we're trying to locate the location where um, Voss, uh, the author of uh, Black Edelweiss, where he said that he had a machine gun position from which he observed uh, Colonel Sparks uh, retrieve the, the guys from the tank and earn his silver star, or a silver star. Um, we are, if you see right there in the middle of the map, the words uh, silence, silence, we are right about between the N and the C. Uh, and what I wanted to do is uh, kind of show you what it looks like around here. So I'm going to pan up and let the camera adjust a little bit. This is looking uphill towards the north. Coming around, still panning to the north. Now, uh, here, back there, between the trees, you can't see it. They're all covered with snow and everything's white. But um, the Hohe Ebersberg and actually the the position that um, 3rd of 157th and the other elements of 157th uh, were fighting would have been up there. And then also you can see through the trees over here, uh, back behind that, you can see uh, the Ebersberg, which is that finger that goes down from the Hohe Ebersberg. And then you can see across there. Let me bring you back and then look down towards the valley and we're looking down into the Spielbachtal and you can look down into it we're having some problems um, finding the right bridge the the um, where Sparks was the um, uh, forestry guys have, have changed a lot of stuff up here uh, with we're with someone here who has been out with uh, people who were well with veterans and have looked at it and um, it's all kind of different and apparently in the last 10 years the forest has, has really changed um, so we're still continuing to to search and, and try and figure out where uh, Voss's machine gun position was and I, I'm panning now Voss mentioned some uh, some rocks that his uh, position was near some rocks and I'm panning up now looking sort of towards the northwest and you can see all of these rocks back here in the background so maybe it was among these rocks up here we're, we're not really sure um, but I still wanted to show you the area here and particularly how it looks under all of this snow of course back then there wouldn't have been so many trees but uh, this is the area okay